Oh. Are you tired of having bad audio quality while gaming on your PS5 or your Xbox? Well, it's time to level up your audio game with the SteelSeries Arctis Nova Pro Wired or wireless gaming headset. Hey there, gamers. My name is Brandon, and welcome to Creighton TV. In this video, I'll be reviewing and showing you how to get the most out of your Steel Series Arctis Nova Pro Wired or wireless gaming headset for your PS5 or your Xbox. From crystal clear audio to unbeatable comfort, this headset has it all. So here's how you connect your game DAC, game base station console. So if you get the Xbox version, turn it around, you can see there's two slots. There's one for Xbox, one for USB. The USB one is the one that you use for PlayStation. I'm gonna use the USB. If you got PC, you got your line in and line out. So connect your port, it's all connected, wire it up. You wanna take your next headset cable. This cable right here will go plugged into the side right here for your headset and the other one, the other end. So you'll take this end, the side that turns and plug that into game base station. The other end goes into your headset. You do not need to plug none of this into the controller. So with this Still Series Arctis Nova Pro wired gaming headset, they also make a wireless version of this gaming headset for Xbox or PlayStation, but I did get the wired one for Xbox and it works on PlayStation. It does come with adjustable straps that's in the inside, as you can see. Um, you can also change, swap out this right here, this strap color. They do have some on Steel Series website. I'll leave a link to it down in the description box down below. You know, you get a retracting microphone that is noise cancellation. Over the ear headset looks great, the quality, but keep in mind, out the box, this headset sounds, woo! Sounds excellent, right out the box. But I'm gonna show you a little features how if you don't have a PC, how you can make the headset sound even better off the PlayStation or Xbox using the game base station. Well, first things first, here's how you connect it. See that it's already plugged in. If you're using PlayStation and you have the Xbox version, you wanna make sure you plug it, your, connect your base station to the USB port. If you have Xbox, use Xbox. You're gonna take this cable here, it's gonna go on to the side of the base station. Just like that, you take this other cable and this goes into your headset. You do not have to plug it into your controller. Audio will come through, you should be good to go. What your setup will look like, it's like that. This is the wired, if you're using wireless, it should be just exactly the same but just you're using a wireless you know you can control your volume turn into uh turn switch keep in mind everybody's ears is different processes audio differently so if you want to change your audio settings what they have on playstation and xbox press and hold on the big button you see how you get your input settings and it says usb input if you tap on there it'll let you know if you're on usb or xbox so only two settings so on the wired version this is your back button on the wireless version you click it in to go back audio options you also have, you know, you can customize, you get gain, you can raise it higher, low, side tone, mic volume, and mic mute. Equalizer, you wanna hit custom. You can custom your EQ. You can have what they have here. They have a few of them that's set, like smiley, focus. You can, you can raise the boost, or you can just leave it flat. It's the only settings that they got. If you wanna do custom, you just gotta turn it to custom, and you can adjust accordingly your settings to what your liking is. Hit back, you can have your high, your gain high or low. I got mine set to high. Side tone, they have high, medium, low, and off. I just left mine to medium, mic volume, and so on. Also, so from there, you can, it tells you what line out or line in you got. You know, stream or speakers, just leave mine to stream. And then you got system settings. You got a tutorial on how to use this, and then you can reset. Pretty simple, easy functions going and enhancing your audio to the next level. So go ahead and check this, Check these features out. Let me know in the comment section down below what do you think about them. And if you own this headset, how's it ha how has it been working out for you? Still Series Arctis Nova Pro Wired or wireless gaming headset is compatible with Mac, PC, PlayStation, Nintendo Switch, and Xbox. If you want to take this headset to the further, you will need a PC. That's where you use the Still Series GG software and the Sonar software to make this headset even better. Keep in mind that everybody's ears is always different. Different, so everybody's going to process sound differently. But hey, you know, you can just get the little base station. But I'll leave a link down in the description box down below where you can check out Still Series D, uh, GG app and software. Well, here's what the Still Series Arctis Nova Pro Wired or Wireless Gaming Headset. Here's how you can make it better on Windows PC and Mac. 
visit stillseries.com slash GG. I'll leave a link to it down in the description box down below. So you can download the Still Series GG software. This software is available for Windows PC only. Once downloaded, the software can be used to enhance your Still Series Arctis Nova Pro wired or wireless gaming headset. You want to make sure that you download Sonar and the Hemet software to get the most out of your headset. The Sonar software helps you customize your audio settings to your liking. The Hemet software provides immersive 3D audio and other audio enhancements. So by using these softwares together, your Artist Nova Pro wired or wireless gaming headset, you can elevate your gaming experience to the next level. Intel processor Mac and you want to be able to run Windows on your computer. I'll leave this link down in the description box down below. This is for the Intel where you can run Windows Bootcamp on your Mac. That way you can use uh, upgrade your Still Series Arctis Nova Pro wired or wireless gaming headset to enhance the audio settings to your liking. So this website will be down in the description box down below. This is for Intel based Macs only. If you have the Intel processor, if you have the space to run it and you can follow all the steps and the requirements down below. For my other Mac users that are using an M1 or an M2 Mac, well, Windows came out with a solution for you guys. They have two options where you can run Windows 365 cloud PCs on your Mac or want run Windows 11 Parallels desktop. Keep in mind, both of these are a subscription service, which they are not free. They do give you a free day trial if you want to try it out. So I will leave this link down in the description box down below. Also, we'll leave um, 9 to 5 Mac's website, how he shows you step by step how to install uh, Parallels on M1 and M2 max down below so check out these two links down below for my m1 users so thanks for watching i hope you're ready to take your gaming experience to the next level with the steel series artist nova pro wired or wireless gaming headset and oh yeah don't forget to like this video and subscribe to creighton tv for more awesome gaming tips and tricks for your ultimate gaming experience and i'll see you in the next video take care and god bless